Twilight Masquerade is almost here. So today, we're opening three Temporal Forces half booster boxes. What can we pull today? Let's find out. All right, so we've got Twilight Masquerade coming up very, very soon. Today, we're opening three of these half booster boxes. This will be the last Temporal Forces episode in a while, so I wanted to do something big. Three half booster boxes seems about right. So let's get started. So last time we opened these half booster boxes, we didn't get a single special illustration or a gold card. We did get about two illustrations per box and one a spec card. Uh, we got a bunch of uh, regular EXs as well. So let's see how it fares in comparison today. Hopefully the pulls are even better. Uh, they were quite good last time, but they can be better. Giraffe Rig, Mudsdale and a Drampa. We still got plenty to collect in the set. Those special illustrations seem to be very difficult to get. We've, we have one in total right now, which is the Salvatore, which we got twice. Hopefully we don't see it a third time and we get some more variety on those special illustrations. So let's go Airy, Totodile. We've got Minchino. Very nice. Illustration rare Minchino. And another Drampa behind. That's a very nice pull. I think I'll do it li like last time. So after each of these half booster boxes, I'll show the pulls of the half booster box and then we will move on to the next box. So you can you can see more or less what you'll get on each of these boxes. Let's go Roserade, Excadrill, Electivire, Caldeo and a Maraida. Hopefully in Twilight Masquerade, the pull rates are a bit better than this for the special illustrations because these have been quite tough to collect. Dealing Colossal. I think we're going to do fine in general for the collection, but those special illustrations are going to be tough. Uh, Bramblegast and a Torterra EX. Even though the Pokemon company says no, I think there might be some seeding in these boxes with the occasional special illustration thrown in the mix at least it felt consistent with the half booster boxes that we opened before as we get the work trio ex full art very nice in its terraform not the gengar ex today not the gengar ex this time We'll see the other boxes. We might get <laughs> we might get work trios in all of the boxes. We'll see what happens. The Meditite, Savalai, come on. I want a special illustration here. The Ponita, Chinchino, and we've got a Mel Metal. Special illustrations, very hard to get. A lot of cool, a lot of cool stuff though on those special illustrations. I think there's a nice spec in this one. I think I saw purple. Let's see. Yeah, that's definitely purple. We've got a Neo Upper Energy A spec card. We've got the Hand Trimmer and the Relicanth. Yeah, there's a lot of cool art. A lot of really cool cards to collect in the set. On those special illustrations. The illustrations are also awesome. I'll, I'll admit that. The full art DXs, I'm not a big, as big of a fan, but they're all right. They're collectible. All right, we're, we're crushing through this half boost box. A lot of cool pulls already. A lot of cool pulls. I really like, I really like that Minchino. That's a cool one. As we get the Licky Licky, Ancient Booster, Energy Capsule, and a Crichton. So what do I expect? What else do I expect here? Another full RTX, uh, one more illustration, and one more EX or two EXs. I, I can't remember. But it was something like that. Uh, we got a Mr. Mime followed by Raishu. That seems to happen a lot. The Mr. Mime followed by Raishu. We got an Iron Leaves EX. We've seen this boy quite a few times now. Let me know what your favorite special illustration is on this set. There are so many cool ones. I really want to get a Mortis Conviction. That's one of my chase cards. That's for sure. We get a lot of Drampus. The Raging Bolt is also very cool. That's another chase for me. Iron Leaves is also quite cool in the special illustration. So 
Yeah, this, the special illustrations in this set are so good. So, so good. That's why I want to collect them all. <laughs> Even though it's not easy. Let's go reverse Raichu, Unpheasant, and then Maridon. There should still be a couple of pulls left in this pile. And then we'll move on to the next box. Let's go. Come on, Metang. Grottle. Uh, give me some good pulls, Mudbray. Full Metal Lab. And a Whimsicott. It is quite difficult <laughs> to get everything in the set. Obsidian Flames, a lot easier. Obsidian Flames, a lot easier. <gasps> We got the Iron Crown EX special illustration. Look at that. So cool. That's awesome. That is such a cool card. I am so happy about this. This is awesome. This is so awesome. As I was saying, it's so hard to get these special illustrations. And it looks awesome. Very, uh, very cool. Love it. <laughs> that, that was great. <laughs> that was great. This half booster box already worth it. That's for sure. Very good. Very, very good. Let's go. But we can, we can still ask for more, right? We can still ask for more. Let's go. Puffin. Elgium. We got a Relicanth illustration, alright, and a Feraligator. Let's go. The Relicanth illustration. Same as last week, or a couple of weeks ago, but I'm sure we got this. Only three more packs in the first uh, half booster box. Let's see what else we can pull. In all the episodes we've pulled a special illustration, we've also pulled a gold card. So we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens in this one. Iron Valiant, Sandy Chocks, Reuniclus, a Driver, Heavy Baton, and Iron Thorns. Let's go for the final two packs. Temporal Forces, come on. For some good luck. Haunter, Pikachu, a Ghastly. The illustration on the Ghastly is so good. Really want to see that. A uh, Sharpedo, we've got a Metagross, a Minchino, a Scyther. And we've got Incineroar EX. And for the final pack, can we get something good? Let's go. Elgium, a Meltan, a Nuzleaf, a Minchino, Mist Energy, a Sauzbuck, Code Breaking Samurai, Reuniclus, and we've got a Salvatore, full art. All right, quite good. A very good half booster box. <laughs> this was, this is the best half booster box so far. No contest. We got a Torterra EX, Iron Leaves EX, Incineroar EX, a Neo Upper Energy A Spec, a Relicanth Illustration, Minchino Illustration, Work Trio EX, a Salvatore Full Art, and we've got the Iron Crown EX Special Illustration. Let's get the second half booster box. Alright, if this one is as good as the previous one. I'm gonna be very happy. We do need all the luck we can get. Not easy to complete this set. Let's go. First pack magic. We're gonna get started and it's gonna be awesome. Let's go. Charge a bug. Slugma. Come on. Ancient booster energy capsule. A Mr. Mime reverse and an incineroar. <laughs> I have to say, not the start I had in mind. But it's alright. We got plenty more packs to open, so a good chance we'll still be able to pull some, some good stuff. Code card, and we've got, starting with a Pikachu, could be a sign of good luck. Everyone loves the Pikachu. Meryl says hi. A Girafferig. We've got a Golurk, an Iron Valiant. <laughs> Next up. <laughs> and Temporal Forces, come on. Solosis, Skitty, Electabuzz. I love these Pokemon, it's so cool. There's the Bolton, Pinnacle, and Metang, and the Dun Dun Sparse. 
So we got a 1EX so far. But yeah, the, the, the other half booster box was the same, right? Two regular EXs. Then we got two full arts. Uh, one of them was a Pokemon EX. The other one was a trainer card. We also got two illustration rares. And then we uh, we got to the 1A spec as well. And then the added special illustration. So it might be a pattern. It might be that these are somewhat seeded. And I say this because we've opened the six booster bundles last week. And we got no A spec cards at all. And in all three half booster boxes that we've opened so far, we got one A spec. Let's see if that happens as well today. We got the Iron Boulder EX Full Art. Let's go. Very nice. A cool future Pokemon. That's a nice full art. Not a Woke Trio EX. So it seems like it won't happen what happened last week. Two weeks ago, I mean. All of these episodes, they start they start to mix in my head. Liden, Shroomish, Salvatore, Palafin, come on, Screamtail, Colossal, Sosbuck, and a Bramblegast. Should be about time for one illustration. I'd like the Drampa and I'd like the Ghastly. Those are the two... I think the two of the ones that I actually would really, really like. More than the others. All of them are welcome. We got a Ghastly, a Bronzor, and a Coridon as a code card. And we've got a Lickitung to start the Slugma. We got a Heavy Baton. We've got everything. We've got everything we need. A Bronzong, a Mighty Inna, and another Iron Leaves EX. Not bad. We will need more. We will definitely still need more, but not bad so far. Ekans, come on, third wick. Poochian. Let's go. Iron Threads, Puffin, a Reller, a Screamtail, and a Whimsicott. Bit of a slower start on this second half booster box. Maybe all the pools are at the bottom of this pile. But it was a bit of a slower start, I think. Let's see how it goes from here. Got Mist Energy, Sauzebuck. Fortress, Grottle, and Iron Thorn. Okay, because we've got three pulls so far. We usually get, what? what is it, seven? Seven pulls total, I think. Uh, maybe it's not, it's not too far off the average. Now that I think about it and see how many packs we still have. <laughs> All right, Wiglet, a Behem, and a Drampa. Temporal Forces, next pack. We start with a Roselia. We got a Relor. We've got Iron Valiant Reverse, Medisham, and a Maridon to end. All right, only six packs left. And <laughs> we're technically missing a lot of pulls if, if we think the average is correct. So this, this might be a pull fest from this point on, on this half boost box. At least that's my hope. Sandy Shocks, Deerling, Skitty, and a Melmetal. All right. I'm starting to get a bit concerned. It is a bit concerning now. All right. Starting with a Ponyta. Very good. Uh, we got a Rapidash. There's no more evolutions there, so not sure what's coming up. Sharpedo. Oh, we got a Rapidash again. <laughs> and a Crichton EX. Nice Crichton EX. We only have four packs left, so I'm not sure how this is going to work. We haven't pulled any illustrations yet, at all. We got one full art EX and we got two regular EXs. No A specs either. So, okay, there's the A spec, the Master Ball again, all right. Not bad, Saloses and a Relicanth. I don't know, are we getting two illustrations in a row or something like that? It can happen. It can definitely happen. Come on, let's go. Pucci and we got the Wiglet. A Colossal. The Jungle. A Sea Dot. And a Mag Cargo. Okay. Seems like this boost box won't be as good. I don't mind being proven wrong by some sort of special illustration now. 
but at least for now it looks like this might be a bit of a, a worse half booster box. Samurai, we got another Relicanth. Okay, I'm getting a bit, um, a bit upset with these repeated illustrations. <laughs> another Relicanth. Nothing against the Relicanth, but it's it's uh it. <laughs> It has been quite a few relicanths in my life recently. Unpheasant. Airy. We got a Delusion. A Finizen. And we got the Iron Crown EX. Alright, that's a cool full art EX. Very nice. Alright, second half boost box. We got Iron Leaves EX. Incineroar EX. Crichton EX. A Master Ball spec. A Relicanth Illustration. The Iron Crown EX. And the Iron Boulder EX. Final half booster box from Temporal Forces. Probably actually the final Temporal Forces half booster box that I'll ever open. Because after this I've got uh, booster boxes, complete booster boxes. I just wanted to see how the pull rates were on these half booster boxes. To see if they, they were sort of the same as the full boost box. Or if they were any better. Any more chances of getting those special illustrations that everyone is looking for. <laughs> I need to try to take them. I need to try to take those chances. Hand Trimmer. Rafska. We've got a Bronzong Perilous Jungle and the Iron Boulder EX. Alright, starting with a EX card. In an ideal world, all of these packs would have hits. And this would just be the beginning. <laughs> Some sort of uh, broken box or god box, whatever you want to call it. Uh, Dunsparce. We got Bianca's Devotion trainer card. All right. <laughs> the hope <laughs> is still alive. That is a nice trainer card. <laughs> Can we get another pull? Can we do it? <laughs> I'm. I certainly hope. Meditate. I would love that. Imagine if all of these packs had pulls. Okay, okay. We got the reboot pod, a spec card. All right. <laughs> Three in a row with the Maridan at the end. Very nice. The streak continues. Can we get a fourth one? Is this a broken box? Let's go. We gotta, we gotta keep going. A Meltan. Let's go, Mudsdale. Uh, we got a Colossal there. Reller. Lickitung. And a Whimsy card has broken the streak. <laughs> the streak is no more. That was kind of sad. Kind of a sad way to end. But. We still got plenty, of, plenty more packs. We might get another special illustration. We might get a gold card. And we got the Raging Bolt EX gold card. All right. <laughs> Very nice. Again, in episodes, we get a special illustration. We get a gold card. Not complaining. Very cool. I wonder if it's possible to get a special illustration as well as a gold card. I know the chances will be low, but... It could be possible. Imagine getting two special illustrations in one episode. That would be the dream. Unpheasant. We got Airy, Iron Valiant, a Carcoal, and a Feraligator. I don't know why the gold cards end up being so cheap in comparison. The special illustration is very expensive. The gold cards, it's like no one actually really, really wants them. And the value goes down significantly. It is a bit surprising. Th they are more rare. I guess the art isn't as good. I'll admit that. Uh, the special illustrations are always a lot more unique. Unique in terms of design. And the landscape. Everything is, is much better. So I do, I do get why. We got a Torterra EX. It just goes to show you that... It's not just about how rare a card is, but also if the demand is there. If someone is willing to pay for that card. Or not. 
They should definitely try something else with these gold cards. Something different for the higher tier. Or just get rid of it altogether. A Reuniclus and a Dundon Sparse. If they got rid of the gold cards and did more special illustrations and made it so that the gold card slots were also special illustrations, that, that would be my preference personally. You might like gold cards though, so I'm not saying it's the right choice for everyone and that everyone would be happy. Savlai, a Scyther and a Melmetal. Just saying me personally, I don't really care about the gold cards. The special illustrations are the best parts of the set. Also like the illustrations. So illustrations and special illustrations are the highlights for me. Always. Let's go. A couple more packs left. We haven't pulled anything nice in a, a while now. As we pull a Bramblegast. <laughs> Our last hit was a Torterra EX. But then again after the start we got, it, it was to be expected. Things would slow down. Let's go. But we still, we should still get at least one illustration, right? Rescue board. We've got Sandy Shocks, a Feraligator. We got a Deerling and a Coridon. Still a nice card to get. A Mighty Yenna, a Dujan, Haunter, Pikachu, Excadrill, a Caldeo. Delmise, a Rubombi, a Pidove. <laughs> And just a whimsy card. Five packs left. Come on. Can we get some more pulls? We got a gold card. We start with a Mr. Mime, followed by a Raishu. They're, they're always together. Very suspicious, if you ask me. Fortress, Future Boost Energy Capsule, Mac Cargo, and a Flood of Main. A very suspicious pairing there. So, what is next? We got a Ghastly. We got a Sizzlypede. We could get a ghastly illustration. I would be happy with that. Let's go Yamper. A Cottony and a Raging Bolt EX. <laughs> there is a big pile of bulk next to me at the moment. <laughs> I, I can show you the entire bulk that we got from all of these half booster boxes. Finizen uh, done sparse. We got Full Metal Lab, Shaman, a Metagross, Arbok, and Iron Valiant. Alright, let's switch the order of the packs. It's something that we haven't done in a while. At least that I remember. Hopefully, hopefully I haven't just done it in the last episode and I already forgot. Snom, Pikachu, Scyther, Sizzlypede. Come on, I believe. I believe we can pull something good still. Iron Treads and a Mac Cargo. And for the final pack, we got... Oops. <laughs> Almost threw all the cards down. Uh, Dunsparce, Snom, a Mudbray, a Great Tusk, a Delcat, Explorer's Guidance, Slugma, Electabuzz, and a Maridon. The final half boost box had a Torterra EX, Iron Boulder EX, Raging Bolt EX, Reboot Pod, a Deerling Illustration, a Bianca's Devotion, and we got the Raging Bolt EX Gold Card. Alright, plenty of pulls today. Out of three half boost boxes, I know it was a lot, but we got the Iron Crown EX special illustration that looks so so awesome. A lot of good pulls. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. This is all the bulk we got. What am I going to do with this? <laughs>